reason why I came to Wichita State is because, uh, you know, on my visit, one of the one of the main things I did was come to a game. I mean, it was just so loud and exciting in here that I made up my mind right there that I wanted to come to Wichita State. The energy, the passion of our fan base, through thick or thin, they're going to be there with us. Wichita State has done so much for me, you know, it's, it's made my future that much brighter. The biggest way it's affected me and influenced my life is um, how I approach challenges. Definitely instilled a great work ethic in me and uh, knowing that things won't be easy but you still got to work for them and just try to accomplish your goals. You know, you need to meet those challenges head on, you know, and almost enjoy it. And, uh, you know, having that mindset, I know it's going to help me out uh, tremendously in my life. I look for guys that play really hard, that have an IQ in basketball that's high, that play smart basketball. I look for guys that are team players and are tough. Being able to put the ball in the basket, playing hard, playing smart are, are concepts that I look for. And having an opportunity to coach some fine young men each and every day is, is, a, is a blessing. Games, we have like a little, you know, little song or a chant that we uh, sing. We go like, "Hey yo, here we go! Hey yo, here we go!" And then somebody be like, "Did we get that dub?" And we be like, "Yeah." Well, Coach Marshall, he like tries to get new people, you know, to to do the chant and things like that. So uh, he'll be, he'll stand up in the middle of the crowd and he'll explain to him, be like, "Okay, you gotta go. Hey ho, here we go." And he looks at him and go. And you say, did we get that dub? And he looks at us and goes, so guys gonna say yeah. And he goes back <laughs> and you're gonna say, are we moving up? And he looks at him and goes, yeah, and then we're gonna all say, hey yo, here we go. Hey, do you wanna come up here and help him? And he always asking people out the crowd. <laughs> it's fun, man. When we get back in the locker room, it's all fun, man. Disappointing time after we lost to Indiana State, but my, my favorite time was was how close, how much more close we got from from that Indiana State loss till our next game against Nebraska. I remember the crowd against Nebraska and against the College of Charleston here, and how loud they were and how energized uh, to a fever pitch. Uh, Shocker Nation was for those particular games. A lot of memories uh, that I have as a, as a shocker, but um, you know, by far my favorite is just winning the NIT. When the buzzer went off in the last game against Alabama in the second half, and just you know, running towards all my teammates and everyone just celebrating and just knowing that you're a champion. It was really special because we all worked so hard, you know, from our freshman year up until now. And, and to have that be our last game, um, and to hold that trophy, you know, it's just 
짠 보이고 First day we got back from uh <laughs> from uh, New York and just the whole atmosphere just people are already at the you know the, the airport and then bus ride here everyone waving showing love and then when we got here all the people that showed up just to congratulate us and you know see us and things like that from uh from my standpoint was just unbelievable and that would probably be the memory that stick me for the rest of my life. We've had a special year and we're not done. That's the beautiful thing about it. We're just getting started. I think I think with everyone's continued effort, passion and energy We've got some great things in store for this basketball program in this university.